Hey, welcome to my channel, The Jamie Joe Show. In this video, I am reacting to The Walking Dead Season 11, Episode 7, Promises Broken. It looks awesome! We, they, we get to see so many groups. We get to see the Commonwealth. We get to see Maggie's group with Negan and Father Gabriel and Elijah. We get to see the Reapers. All of this in one episode. So I'm assuming that it's going to be an amazing episode and it is not going to disappoint. I haven't watched it yet. I'm going to watch it early on AMC+. Plus. You can also check it out at its regularly scheduled time on Sunday nights on AMC. Either way, you've got to watch it. I know it's going to be good because they have been crushing season 11. There's my cat meowing. Season 11, every episode has been so good, so I'm sure this one's going to be awesome too. I can't wait to see it. If you like this video, hit the like button, and if you like my channel, think about subscribing. That would be so cool. Uh, and a note about last week's video that I posted. I had asked everyone if you would like my videos to be shorter or if I should keep them a little longer. I got quite a few comments asking to keep it longer, and I thought that was awesome, so I was going to keep them longer, and then I ran into some copyright issues. So I ended up having to shorten my video down to barely five minutes, so I apologize for that, and hopefully that does not happen with this week, and I can keep it at a better um, length. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Thank you to my new subscribers. Hello to all of you. And a, also a big thank you to my subscribers who have been there for me since day one. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thanks for watching and enjoy the reaction. Wait. Take a minute. And we're almost there. About three miles out. You can't be serious. Daryl just told us to go home. I didn't hear that. Well, I think he was being subtle. He said they were armed with lookouts. And Daryl knows I would never turn back. How do you keep going, Maggie? Huh? With what army? Come on, Gabe. Back me up here. Our people are about to starve. I'm not going back to my family having failed. Ah, Jesus. At least admit what you're asking of us. Walking to our deaths for what, a, a sack of beans? If you're more interested in saving yourself, protecting the people back home, you can go. We don't need you. We both know that's not true. I tell you what, you make me a promise in front of the goddamn priest, and I will stick around. Promise you what? I do this for you. Don't worry. We are good. I don't have to keep looking over my shoulder. We will never be even. Then you are going to be down a soldier that you desperately need. Your call. You take a promise from me? Really? Yeah. Who would? I'm assuming you are a woman of your word. I've always been a man of mine. What is it? His sister's best friend, Teresa. She was just a kid. We have to get them. All of them. Hey. Y'all know Blackbeard, too. Wait. I think we can 
done more. services to... Miss Milton and her cabinet. Right. Hornsby's expectations of the timing were a little different. Is he your supervisor? No. Then I'd like to speak to her right away. Please. <laughs> Blessed are the dead who die in the Lord, even so save the spirit, when they rest from their labors. And say the Lord be with you in my spirit. Amen. Your sister's out there. You'll find her. Never last one of these murderers. All of them. But the one. He's mine. anywhere sir we try to build and set about a light yes sir along with train track yes sir freeway on the passes yes sir oh come on there are dozens of these assholes out there oh. no your brothers are dead are you not ashamed or do you think this is acceptable? They were following my recommendations. I told them where the last teams went. I told them where to go next. You want to scream at somebody, scream at me. You trying to be noble? Is that it, Shaw? You trying to get them to like you? Try keeping them alive. And Nelly Adams going to do that. Oh. 
up with you, Scott. Take your boy over there and go and find my goddamn enemies! Hey, you don't understand. It's easy for you out here on your own, only having to worry about yourself. We have a whole community to protect. And we have a structure. And a leader who got us this far. What happened back there? That was not even normal. Yeah, I met guys like that before. Pope's got a puzzle to solve and he's riled up. How can these people be so hard to find? And kill everybody and then he goes back to being a good guy? He's like a father to me. He believed in me when no one else would. He made me strong. I doubt you ever needed anyone to make you strong. Through the darkest of times. I treasure our conversation and the guidance you have given me. Is there anything I should know? Anything I should know? That's nice for you. Someone like me would never meet Miss Milton. Why not? You have to know your place. Hey,
told you to get it right. Congrats and you're welcome. That's changed. Can't know that. It's helpful. It would be. Unless there's something in it for him. So, your promise? I hope I can keep it. the soldiers looking for people like you. How'd you avoid them? I, I, I don't know what that means. Then you're of no use to us. You don't know what we've been through. My, my wife's hurt real bad. I can't, I can't care for her and look for food. Please just, just let me go. Show us. I'll shoot you find your family later. Okay. Just please don't hurt us. Well. Show the Hold up. We found a man in the woods. Not sure if he's part of our target. He's taken us to his people. How do you want us to engage? children at the satellite station. No families. Then where'd Aaron get crazy? Think I don't know about that? You can't debate battle plans with me. Levels of cruelty. Look, all I'm saying is that I remember when my home was invaded and my people were killed. Those men, they had friends. They had girlfriends, people that felt a loss that I couldn't heal. And I had to explain to them why, why their leader failed to protect them. He killed people who had families. And he did it in front of their families. Yeah, I did. But the world is different now, Maggie. Fewer people to fight for, fight with. Hell, there's fewer things to fight over. You're saying you do things differently? Yeah. Yeah, if I could do it all over again, I'd have killed every single one of you. Why would you say that to me? We had a good day, you and I. And the only way this works, Maggie, is... 
as if we're honest. Where do they bring these exactly? Uh, I don't know. Somewhere far from the fields and the water supply. Perhaps! <laughs> Much gratitude. I see you've done all my work for me. And I didn't even bring the lollipops. Wait. <laughs> you don't want one? Oh, I have had several. <laughs> so how was it? Good as new. I got antibiotics, painkillers. It's still there. You run into any of them? No. their dictionary hey, Eugene. Now, just a minute. We have earned either gratitude or an apology, whichever this young man can muster first. Eugene, who the hell do you think you are? I think I'm talking some Eugene. extremely rude right Eugene. now. Now, just hold your horses one second. You have no idea who you're talking to. Oh, <laughs> gross. Stupid bitch! Look what you just did to my girlfriend! <laughs> oh, 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 God, what did you do? This guy was being, well, an asshole. <laughs> Look, we're, we're so sorry. Touch. We've been working with that break of... He didn't mean to. Perfectly untrue. Did you hit him? Yes, but... What the hell are you thinking? Don't you know who that is? Oh, yeah. It's Pamela Melton's son. Hi, I'm Yumiko Okamura. I'm here for my meeting with Ms. Melton. Thank you for being on time. Miss Milton is fastidious about her schedule. Would you like a herbal tea? No, thank you. Are you all settling in okay? Yeah, I mean... Oh, she wants to know about Eugene. I haven't seen my friends in a few days, so... Oh. I'm sorry to hear that. Is everyone okay? Yes? Yes. Of course, I'll, I'll do it now. Is everything okay? I'm afraid Miss Milton will have to reschedule. Someone just attacked her son. A situation like that? You're supposed to save him. Protect the governor's son. You'd have been a hero. You could have asked for anything. I did. My apologies. I did not ascertain such a conclusion. All right, now we're screwing around. You want out, now the price is higher. I need the name of your town and how to get there. That is beyond my purview. Then welcome. Wait.
You need to take your son and run. Don't ever come back here. Go with your dad. You killed him. It'll be good for you. Oh, they have so many of them. <laughs> 